Good morning, Wildcats. Today is Wednesday, World Food Day, October 16th. I'm Colin Yarbrough, and welcome to WCTZ News. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Tickets for next Tuesday's Super Smash Bros. Tournament will be on sale today and tomorrow during Power Hour. Tickets to participate will be $10 in advance and $15 the day of the event, and to spectate will be $3 in advance and $5 the day of the event. The Wearable Electronics Club will be holding a Halloween-themed creative event today in Ms. Johnson's room 4100 during Power Hour A and B. All boys planning on trying out for soccer need to turn in their paperwork today to Ms. Henderson, Mr. Henderson in room 5100. The Animal Advocacy Club is holding a pet supply drive until Monday for the Wildlife Emergency and Rehabilitation Hospital. Items needed are listed on posters around the school, and supplies can be dropped off in Ms. O.T.'s room 3200. Now to Riley Wilkins with a story on Pokemon Go. Gotti. Pokemon Go has made a comeback in 2019. The game initially released in 2016, but a few dedicated Pokemon fans have still been playing. You may not have noticed, but a few West Shore students have become very enthralled with the game. In case you didn't know what Pokemon is, it's basically a game where you collect little creatures and you battle other creatures. And Pokemon Go brings Pokemon to the real world. To play, um, it varies. Generally when I'm around friends, like, I usually like, uh, I trail off and just find any Pokestops nearby. My most prized Pokemon would probably have to be my Sudowoodo. Um, it does remind me of a friend I have dear to my heart. Uh, his name is James. I'm in Wickham Park like all the time, just biking around. I don't always play Pokemon Go when I uh, go to Wickham Park, but it's really easy to when I do. And uh, I try to solo one and two star raids by myself when I can't find people to raid with. Uh, I really like Agron and uh, a, a lot of the legendaries, but I haven't caught that yet. This has been Riley Wilkins reporting for WCTZ News. Thank you for tuning in to today's edition of WCTZ News. This has been Colin Yarbrough. Have a great day, Wildcats.